Hello everyone, my name is Hunter's World Gaming. Welcome back to I Live Under Your House. Now, we just got done with the main story, but there's still more to come as we find the first and second endings to this main story right here. But, welcome to Let's Play the DLC story. Now, I think that I never knew we, we actually have both the main story and DLC stories to it. So, we just got done with the main story as our run right there but let's see if we get our run in the dlc story so with that let's see what the difference between this and the dlc is like i am not a coward but i am scared oh okay this is a continuation to the main story eh? okay the lights are out and the door is open i don't like the look of this all right i'll just check to see if anybody's home Okay, so let's go inside the house. Man, every horror game when you go inside the house to investigate the paranormal. Yep, things really happen. Can I get on my flashlight? Oh my god, okay, I do have a flashlight with me. Ah, oh, what a disgusting smell. Oh shit. The door is closed behind me. Good. Oh, wow. Well, whoa, would you look at that? I'm back at the house. Now, apparently. I think that was a part of the main story where you were playing as this child, but then all of a sudden you're playing as a different guy. Okay, that's why I'm standing up taller in this house. That's why I'm seeing the horse. Oh my God, what the fuck is going on here? What kind of a maniac would do this? That is so disgusting. Oh my God. Oh my God, that would be age restricted if I saw this for too long. Oh my god, the downstairs? Are you kidding? Alright, let me check something here first. Oh, there is a brain. Oh my god. It's a human brain in the trash can. Oh my god. What kind of a maniac would do this shit in the house? I did not appreciate that at all. So, uh, the doors are closed, so I'm gonna check this room first. The whole floor is sticky. Well, damn, what the fuck? I don't even want to know what happened here. And there's a box. The box is full of candles. That means I had to go downstairs. So anyway, let's go. And none of this door would be open. Holy shit. Hello, is someone down in the basement? Oh my gosh. The Cave of Wonders? But with only the mouth? What the fuck is this place? God, reminds me of a bit of Aladdin, to be honest. Okay, there is a deep tunnel in front of me with no end in sight. Are you sure you're ready to go into the tunnels? Yeah, sure, why not? And get myself, get my pants shit together. Oh, wow, look at that. It's in the static style right now. Press to crawl. Oh, okay, press to crawl. All right. What is that down there? Hello? What is this? A hat? Workers, helmet. Hell, if there's even the slightest chance that it belonged to him, I can't turn back. All right, let's just keep on moving forward now. What's that noise? Can you hear that? No one's behind me, good. The tunnel seems to be getting narrower and narrower. Holy shit. This is scary, guys. Very creepy. Very creepy, indeed. Oh, God. The air is getting heavier and to breathe. The air is getting heavier to breathe. Okay. Because I know my grammar sounded so fucking horrible with this. What the fuck? What is this? What the fuck? It's so narrow, but I think I can get through. If I put a flashlight in my mouth and crawl like a worm, I think I can do it. Well, here we go. Space bar. All right, space bar. My arms are clasped at my sides. The only thing left to do is to push myself with my feet. 
right. Damn, it's getting harder and harder to breathe. But I don't have a choice anymore. I have to move forward. Oh, shit, shit. I think I'm stuck. I can't move. I'm definitely stuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. I don't want to die in some hole. I need to pull, pull myself together. If I can push all the air out of my lungs, I can get through. I have one last push left, and I'll get out of here. Come on. That's hell. Oh, I did not die. What if I died if I got stuck, if I got myself stuck in there? That would be a different ending. Can't believe I managed to get through. Holy shit. Oh my god. What the fuck? Yeah, there must be a monster behind that hole. I didn't like that sound behind my back. Oh no, please don't turn around. Don't fucking turn around. I swear to God, he's still behind me now. I'm, I don't want to take a risk, everyone, to look behind me. This is horrible. What is this? What the fuck? Can I get through? Wait. Oh, do I have to crawl? Yep, crawl. There we go. All right, under the skull lie withered branches of flowers. It looks like a kind of totem. If you look closely, it's as if someone has scrapped the inscription spirit on the stone. Looks like I've stumbled onto some kind of cult or something. I hope the author of this work isn't home. Oh, wow. That is really creepy as shit, guys. Oh. Oh, God, that noise again. Oh, God. Oh, God. Let's get out. Let's get out. Oh, what the fuck? I never had a triple phobia, but this place makes me feel uncomfortable. It's different in an appearance from other tunnels. I don't think it's been dug. I need to find the way out of here as ASAP. Let me try this way first. What is this? What do we got here? Just a bunch of pebbles. They're pretty smooth. Hmm. They're nice to hold. Really? Okay, let me wait. What is that? I thought that was like another crystal. Let me try the other way. Wait, wait a second. Before I go down there, I want to see what's over here. Wait, there's different ways now? Are you kidding me? Oh! Okay, he fell down. What if, what happens if I went back? Oh yeah, that means you were going in circles. God damn, I did not, never knew. Let me try the other way now. Okay, oh God, really, whoa, that is a lot of skulls, really. What the fuck? Holy shit. Holy shit, that is a lot of skulls. God damn it. All right. Let me go back the other way. I'm gonna go to a different way now. And there we go. All right, moving forward. Okay, I think the wind stopped, but I'm hearing some noise again. Oh, it's me, okay. It's me crawling. That's the sound of me crawling. Okay. I thought it was someone else, but I think I was wrong. All right, thought that's a dead end, but no monster can actually get me in that spot, huh? All right, I can deal with that. Let's just keep going through the tunnels to see what's gonna lead me to. Well, okay, what's that? What is that? Hello? Hello? I feel like I'm crossing the border into the afterlife. I had a similar feeling once before. There's definitely something magical about it all. It's like when I was a kid, 
when I was drawn to different abandoned buildings. I almost died once, too, back then. It was an abandoned hospital, a popular place for teenagers. Guys would go home, would go there, climb on the roof, smoke weed, and, and look at the stars. <laughs> smoke weed every day! <laughs> like Snoop Dogg, holy shit. Didn't go to the roof. Uh, I was more interested in the basement. I even went there all by myself. Sometimes walking through these tunnels, I could suddenly stop and turn off my flashlight. So one day, I stood once again in, in that darkness, listening to the wind walking through the tunnels. That's what I was hearing. Yes, okay. Suddenly, I heard a loud sound like a demonic scream. It was a scrapping of metal mix with a clash of granite blocks. It echoed throughout the corridors. I became unimaginably scared. I started calling for help, but there was no one to answer. But I got out, found a way out of, out of the other side of the building, and when, I, and when I went outside, I saw that half of the building had collapsed. Several teenagers died. They, they were sitting on the roof when the building collapsed. After that incident, I began to take more and more risks. I liked it. I liked the adrenaline, decided to become a police officer because it gave me the opportunity to be on the edge all the time. But these tunnels, there's something different here. I, I've never felt this way before. It excites me and frightens me at the same time. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Okay. What, another crystal? How many crystals are there? Oh my god. Feel the air has changed, so there must be a way out somewhere. Oh, this is the biggest room yet. Holy shit. Can I get back up? Okay, I can get back up. There we go. Alright. Okay, if there is another way I can crawl, I can press E. Okay, I can crawl. Oh, E! There we go. Get in. This opening is even narrower. Than the previous ones, I need to think carefully before I go in there. I can feel fresh air coming from somewhere ahead. This opening is even narrower than the previous ones. The main thing is not to panic like the last time. What was that? No 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 Oh Oh god fuck What was that? Day zero Oh wow 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 what the fuck was that? Chapter five So that's how it continues like after the third chapter then you go to the DLC story and that continues the chapters Holy shit I can only hope that my leg is not broken. The other leg seems to be free. Maybe I can push off of it. Ow! What a pain. Fuck, it's no use. Ugh! Help! Oh, oh, I can't get through. Oh my god. I can't push through! Help! Oh my god! Oh my god, sorry about the loud spamming spacebar sound. That really drives you crazy. Help me! Oh, we're still in chapter five? Five hours? How did it all start? I've, I've, I've been out of work for two months now. Yes, there were a couple of cases, but absolutely uninteresting and it paid a little I even thought about going back to the surface huh of course no one would take me back there the whole town would never forget what I did then the man came in all then this man came in all scared shitless he told me his name was John Nada and he worked at the construction site far out of town Nada told me that he worked with a friend whose name was Bob so Bob went missing Nada went to the police. The police refused to help him. He was not from around here. Essentially a tramp. Nada did his job. How the house was finished. He saved up money. And now he came to me. He just wanted to find his friend. 
I decided to ask around the owners of the house that Nada was building. Maybe they knew something, and here I am. No! I can't give up. I have to get out of here. Okay, here we go. Come on! I'm not going to die in some hole! It seems to be working! I'll be free! What? Oh, I feel so good to finally stretch out to feel the ground beneath my feet. Oh, okay. Now I'm very sorry if you were just watching this. I'm very sorry that it kind of annoyed you a little with the loud noise of me spamming the space bar so that way I can actually get through. So I'm very sorry about that. So no worries, guys. Or Hakuna Matata. All right. Here we go. Continue on. Finally, I was stuck for like fucking five hours. Oh, yeah. Some little bit of a rock music to it, eh? Someone behind me? No? Okay. No one's behind me playing that rock music. I really like the uptown beat to it. Holy shit. Makes my head want to bop. To this rhythm. Holy fuck. Alright, let's just keep moving on still. Holy shit. Holy shit. Oh god, is someone up there? Oh god. Okay. How long is this? How long is this, guys? I don't know. I feel like I'm like moving my mouse up and down when, when I'm bopping to the rhythm. Oh my god. God, that makes me so satisfied when I'm out of this shithole. God damn. Oh. Oh my god, I got a feeling someone is still behind me. No? Alright. Oh, god damn it! Freedom at last! It's great to feel the ground beneath your feet. Stretch your arms out in the different directions. The sound of the leaves. What happiness it is to be outside. There's no way I'm going back. There must be a road somewhere ahead. I've got to find help and get those damn cops to do their job. Oh, damn. Oh, my God, I'm out. God. Whoa! Oh, my God, what the fuck? Wait, that's not a baseball bat. It's a feet! This is my leg. Whoa! Fuck! What? I'm still here? Oh! No! No! You tricked me! You tricked me! You tricked me! Ow! God damn it, my fucking fan just actually headbutted me back. Fuck, I'm still here. I'm still here. I'm still here. I stopped the E and it's not going to spam a lot. Holy shit. I hate this place. I hate rocks. I hate the dust. I hate that my whole body is stiff and I can't straighten up. I just want to get up. I want to straighten my back. I want to bend my knee. Oh, how I want to bend my knee. My leg hurts so bad I want to bend my knee. I hate how I hate everything. Get me out of here, somebody. Get me out of here. Help me. Help me, somebody. I will not be heard. I will never be heard. I'm stuck. 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 Shit! Why did I come here? Why did I come in here? Why did I come here? What did I want? I wanted to help. I wanted to find this guy. That's all. Why didn't I call the police? Why didn't I leave? I wanted to be a hero. I wanted to be useful. Fuck heroes. Fuck them. Nobody needs heroes. Heroes get stuck in holes and die. Like Black Adam. Venom, or whatever, Dr. Fate. Oh shit, I was going down into the, that dungeon, like I was going into battle 
with a dragon. Like Dungeons and Dragons. That's the movie I've been looking forward to watch. Pretty soon, I, I believe. I was expecting the maniac here. I was expecting the horde of killers. I was ready to fight them. I was ready to defeat evil. This is what I had been taught. What I have been prepared for, not this hole. Not this hole. Maybe I'm just an idiot. Maybe that's what I wanted. Maybe I just wanted to die already because I was sick of everything. Because I, I, I don't have a job because no one needs me. No one needs me. This place needs me. This hole needs me. I'm tired of, very tired. My eyes are closing, I must rest. So you're finally awake. I've been waiting for you, though I think you've been waiting for me just as much. Wait, who's there? Get me out of here. Come on, Nick. It's not all that fast. Don't you like it here? Who the hell is here with me? I have no idea. You've been here so long. I thought you liked this place. Screw you. Well, then I should probably go. Go. No, no, no. Please stay. Help me. I'm stuck here. Please don't go. Don't go. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't go. So it wants me to stay. It wants to it wants to get out of here. Yes, please. I don't care who you are or wh or what you did. I didn't see anything. Just get me out of here, please. Please help. So it thinks I own the place? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm just a bystander. Let's just say the owner is away on, on family, family business, but you can't have the house without the master. Can you? I can get you out of here, but I'm going to need something from you. Anything? I'll give anything. Just get me out of here. Anything? Bark from me, Nick. What? I thought you were stuck, not deaf. Bark. Bark for me. Does it, does it want to get out of here? It has to bark. Woof! Whoa, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. That, that, that bar right there was going so fast. Did you see that? Louder! Oh, woof, woof. Louder, it should bark louder. Woof, woof! Louder, bark, whine like a wounded animal. Come on. Woof, 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 Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, hi. Who the hell are you? Yes, Bark. Bark and lose your name. From now on, you will lose everything. You will have no past and no future. You will become a creature persecuted by perpetual hunger and loneliness. And you will survive us and will serve us for 13 long years. In return, I'll, I will free you from these shackles of stone, but your flesh will belong to us. Remember, your flesh belongs to us. I open my eyes and here I am, home again. What an unbearable feeling. Oh my god, what the fuck was that? Even though I've been here as long as I can remember, I hate even in every inch of these tunnels. This place disgusts me. I can't wait to get outside. There we go. The coolness, finally the air is so fresh. And it's snowing out as well. I like to listen to the crackling of the trees to enjoy the slight whiff of the breeze on my skin. However, all this is all this is only a moment when I'm distracted, my thoughts start to get confused. What are thoughts anyway? How do I know what thoughts are? How do I know the words? All these words just pop into my head on their own. And the more I try to understand where the source of all my knowledge comes from, the more it begins to hurt. The hunger begins to grow inside me. It grows stronger and stronger. The voices in the tunnels tell me to kill the tenants of this house, but I don't want to do that, even though I'm hungry. More and more, I stop understanding myself. Something pushes me from side to side, forces me to push to be, forces me for it to be in constant motion. But there are also moments like this when I stop. They seem to be going out for a walk. It's time to return to my underground up a bod before they see me but 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 I so want to stay here for just one more minute in hell it's hell all right okay. there's no point to, in going back hunger will kill me I have to do what I have to do still I would rather not offend anyone if only I had a choice ah! Ah, oh, thank you for playing the end! 
Oh my god, that was fun! That was totally fun! Oh my gosh, well that was totally fun guys. Now guys, I'm... I know there's gotta be the first ending and the second ending to the main story! My fucking mouse just dropped. Yep, there we go. No batteries came out, so I guess I'm good now. Thank you all for watching. That was specifically, I live under my house. That is holy shit. Oh, or your house, not mine. I wish someone lived under my house. That is so fucking scary. Imagine you got stuck in real life and no way you can get out. Other otherwise, you can really starve to death. That would be much more disturbing than the previous disturbing content that we've definitely seen in this video. Thank you all for watching. If you all liked the video, give us a thumbs up. Stay 20% cooler. Be ready for the real action. We will see you guys very, very soon. Bye-bye, everyone.